welcome back. In the previous part, we just started the Time Leap episodes, well, whatever they may be, and it appears we've traveled back in time, and it looks like we're going to run into some uh, um, engineer-type character, so I'm very much looking forward to this. No goggles, though. It's the only downside, only downside, but let's, let's go see. quick to attack us, but they ran away even quicker. They were very, very weak. Everyone knows you can't run away from a final boss. Desco won't let them get away. Wait, that's enough. Thank you for dispersing the soldiers. Who are you? That voice. You're the one who gave us orders earlier. I mean, she's not got goggles, but where's the thing in her, like, in the middle of her forehead? Hmm. Oh, oh, yeah, um, I haven't introduced myself yet. My name is Nagi Clockwork. Oh my god, I love her name. I summoned the two of you to stop the war. I use one of my special mechanology spells. Huh? What the hell are you talking about? Mechanology? This, this could be my favorite character of all time in Disgaea. Anyway, Dusko wants to know where we are. Right, well, uh, there are lots of things I still need to explain to you. But we should get away from this battlefield first. I'll tell you everything once we get to my lab. Please follow me. Wow. Oh, I was, I was wondering, like, why is the story not progressing? So, because this is our, our base now. This is awesome. I like the look of this place so much. It's just fantastic. It's glorious. It's beautiful. It's everything I dreamed of. Right, so, ooh. So just books everywhere. I don't really need the money. I mean, look at my money. Yeah. It's quite quite a bit of money there. I don't really need it. It's just strange, strange place we've ended up in. But it's cool. It's cool. Right, so let, let's speak to Nage. Welcome to my lab. Before we decide where to go next, I need to explain some things. This is my lab. It's beautiful. Oh, it's huge. It's as big as Daddy's lab back home. It's got lots of equipment, too. Oh, Desco has never seen these things. Desco wants to touch everything. I, I, I do like the lack of health and safety going on. I mean, look at the bridge in the middle. You could easily fall off that. Very nice, very nice. Very, very sort of like secret lab set up here. <laughs> I'm way ahead of you, Desco. I've already pressed a button. Desco didn't see that. No fair, big sis. Desco wants to press buttons too. Huh? Hey, stop. I was only kidding. I don't want anything to explode or something. There's nothing that dangerous here, but I do have a trapdoor that leads to the sewers, so please be careful, okay? What? That sounds like something straight out of a comic book. What do you even need that for? Uh, to protect my mechanology spells from thieves, I guess. Um, so just don't play around in here, okay? Hmm. Roger! A final boss must be able to resist temptation! So anyway, why don't you start by telling us which part of Hades we're in? Assuming we're in Hades at all, Fuka. Hades? You're from Hades? Does your reaction mean we're not in Hades? Well, in a way, I guess this place is sort of like Hades, except inhabited by humans. Wait, are we on Earth? How did we get here? You were chosen by my summoning spell to make my dream true. Your dream? To take over the world? N no! I want you to stop this war. Oh, it's quite disappointing. Oh, yeah. You said something about that earlier. But we can do that through world domination, right? This land is a war zone between two nations. This lab lies between the Rekodona Kingdom to the south and the Goostark Empire to the north. 
Those were Rekadona soldiers earlier. I thought really hard about how I could put an end to this war, and then an idea hit me. If we crush every battlefield and drive all the soldiers away, they wouldn't be able to continue the war. But I, I can't take on so many soldiers on my own, so I summoned you two. Understand? Yeah, I guess. Whew. Now let's head on over to the next battlefield. Uh, I think I'll pass. What? Why? Well, you can't summon us and just expect us to fight for you. Not to mention Desko has never heard of Rekadona or Gustark. <gasps> Is this really Earth? Wait a minute. This could be Earth of the past. Maybe we've somehow time leaped. Why won't you obey me? I'm your master, and a master's orders are supposed to be absolute. I don't really care. Can you just send us back? I mean, you can do that, right? Mm. Fine. But only after you fight with me. If you want to go back to your own world, then follow my orders. Wait! That's not fair! Stop it! Let me go! I thought she meant like actually fight with her, like, like a one-on-one -on -one fight, but well, with our entire group. I assume not. Right, so timely. Oh, we got several happening. Alright then. Marching Sandstorm. Look over there. All those Rekadona soldiers are so close to the border. If we don't stop them, they're going to clash with the Gustark army. I can't let that happen. I just remembered this. I, I was like th taking in the CG for the background before the ba the background image from the menu and thinking, what was that game that was like this guy where we went to a desert where we went to sort of like a um, communications tower? It was like we played it like several months ago, and I was like, wait, that was this game. I did play that several months ago. I've been playing this game for months since April. Jeez. Um... It's July now! I just realized I never asked you your names. My name is Fuka Kazamatsuri. I'm a ninth grader at St. Goliath Middle School. I'm just 15 years old! I am the final weapon! Death, extermination, submersible combat organism! I'm also Big Sis's little sister and a final boss. It's quite a difference in their introductions, isn't there? I'm gonna ignore most of what you said, but 15? Could they really be the ultimate warriors? Is this gonna be okay? No, I can't afford to hesitate. I need to trust Father's summoning spell. Alright, Fuka and Desko, are you ready to fight? What should we do, Big Sis? As a proud final boss, Dusko doesn't think she should help a little girl. <sighs> we have no choice. I mean, we can't really get back without her. Okay, if you say so, Big Sis, then Dusko will throw out her pride. Oh my. The soldiers are on the move. Follow me. Set me free, trust me, and we will escape from the city. Oh! We're into the battle. Okay. Are they actually moving off? It's like, oh, that would be interesting if like, they got to the end and that would be like, game over. Like, you don't get there in time. So what I'm going to do... Is I'm going to... Get this done really quickly if I can. Here I come! Just, just go there with this, go. Yog, sof, 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 sof. Execute. I didn't even check their levels, I just assumed Desko's going to destroy them. You can't run from a final boss. Little cheer. Yes. So what level are they? 440? That's like nothing! Bring it! 
Ring it indeed. Alright, so who can we get here? I will destroy evil! So I'm seeing like who can I get out to what? throw people? Yeah. Alright, so where do you go? Take Gig. this! There, please. Oh, I've got to lift you up, haven't I? So the only problem is that because of that, probably won't be able to lift two people on you. So I will destroy evil. Oh, very well. Watch this. So we've used that. Yeah. And now too we've got gig there. It's not too late for regrets, really, is it? I mean, you can still have a few here and there. That's a health load. I didn't heal up. I didn't, I didn't think about healing up at all, did I? Right. So uh, end turn. You need to start going back to Final Fantasy soon. Like, every time I see this boss, I think about Final Fantasy. It's like, I do need to go back and visit them. It would be nice. We'd have to do Final Fantasy 7 before we get the remake. Maybe. Maybe. Um, no! There's no time to rest. Now we have to stop the Gustark army. According to my sources, their soldiers should be gathering just north of here. Fuka, Desko, let's hurry. Yeah, yeah, fine. You shouldn't use a final boss like this. Men, indeed. Okay, so let's back out and actually heal up. That's the one thing I, I failed to take into account that I needed to do. So where is the healing machine, I assume? Oh no, it's just a bed. That girl said that this is Earth, but this isn't how I remember it. But this lab reminds Desko of Daddy's lab. This reminds me when I was younger. I used to play hide and seek, and Dad would always get mad at me. Desko remembers a lot too. What are you two doing? You need to get some rest. I'm just looking around. This machine reminds me of my dad's lab. Your dad's a scientist? Are you interested in these things? Um, well... You looked really interested in it earlier. Do you want to know how everything works? Ah, uh, well, not really. I see. Well, if you insist. All these machines are powered by mechanology. Mechanology uses circles and mechanisms to affect change for various purposes. It's similar to the spells that you use. For instance, the lights on the ceiling. I hung a device that I inscribed the spell circle on. First, I need to send energy through it. Then that energy gets sent into the device, and the lights... Then the lights turn on. This device is rather elementary, especially when compared to the satellite I made. Now, getting real-time images was really hard. Essentially, I discovered that I had to reverse the polarity of the energy that was being sent through the gyroscope and blah 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 blah. No idea what she's talking about. Desko's head is about to explode. She's pretty good. We'd better get some rest. Good night, Desko. Yes, big sis. Good night. And this device is... Huh? Have they had enough? Fuka and company have been healed. Oh, I don't even need to actually do anything about that. See if there's actually any new weapons or anything. Oh, no, it's probably going to be the same, isn't it? I don't know. Maybe there's something new. Doubt it. From the looks of it. Yeah, probably not. Probably not. Right. Okay, let's go to the next one. What have we got then? A time leap. Frozen garrison. There. Goostark foot soldiers. It doesn't look like they know we're here. Charge! Desko can't believe she's treating us like this, big sis. He says charge and then just stands over there. It's like... Yeah, and? We have no choice. Besides, I'd rather do this than just be stuck here. What's the hold up? Hurry! Just a little longer. All right, very well. These guys should be easy enough. What's this, this with this battle over here? Warning, don't throw. Oh, it's so tempting, it's so tempting. But I won't. I'll follow, I'll follow orders. That's what I meant to be doing, right? So I won't throw Bring it. Bring it. Bring it. Um, let's actually... I'm gonna end this. 
Have a mess around. We'll go with fusion, but we'll end turn first. Yes, I know I ended turn. Hmm. I hope they were going to group up better. But, uh, oh, now he's in the way. That's a bit annoying. Okay, so now... Fusion! Desco change! Big Desco. Big, big Desco. Let's put that there and enter. We'll view it. View it once as Big Desco. It's a much bigger skill because Desco is much bigger. You may have noticed this. May have. There's more bombs over there. Ooh. Very interesting. Very, very, very interesting. Just like the noise. Boom. Alright, question is what can I do? Because I'm going to be limited for SP at this point. Looks like which ones do I take out? Take out you two, you two. Go with that and take out these two. So let's enter. In. Complete annihilation! Just imagine how big that sword is now. Quite big from the looks of it. Oh, he dead. He very dead. He, he... He gone. He gone. He gone. Right, we're gonna have to do to get a bit of a weapon in. Oh, we could do that. Could do that. Maybe back up a bit. Yep. We'll do it from there. Um, and turn. Power up! Power up. Bam, bam, bam. That's quite nice. It's quite nice. I like... I like how detailed this drawing is on the right. It's... It's, it's nice to see... These type of characters are really highly detailed. S strange in a way. Um, no. Hey, calm down, both of you! Never! We will destroy everyone! See that mountain over there? Destroyed! Okay, we held up our end of the deal. Now send us back. Oh, use your mecha whatchamacallit spell to send us back right away! Uh, wait, uh, I need to prepare the spell first. What? You better not say you can't do it. No, I can. Then hurry! But, um, you haven't finished what I asked you to do yet. See? The war isn't over. What? Then how many more times do we need to fight? At least six. I think we're almost done. You're gonna, she's gonna keep stringing them along, aren't you? I, I was originally going with the idea that I, I like this character, but no, no. She needs to grow as a person before I like her. Almost? How many more battles? Well, um, maybe like 10? Wait, no, um, uh, 20. Maybe 50. Uh, it shouldn't be more than that. It's gonna be more than that, isn't it? Listen, you. Are you messing with us? I mean, is beating up soldiers left and right even gonna stop the war? Uh, yes. Uh, I need to stop this war, whatever it takes. W wait! Jeez, what's with this girl? Yeah, she's quite strange, isn't she? Alright, so let's do a little bit of healing up. Cocoon Company have been healed. I'm just wondering if there's anything else I can get from here that I won't be able to get back in my normal base. I don't know. I'll stop this war helping Fukrin Desco! Why? Didn't we stop all the soldiers? What? Huh? What is it now? Some Rekadona soldiers made it across the border. We don't have much time. Come on, hurry! Are we going to follow her, big sis? I mean, what else are we going to do at this point? Well, 
If something happens to her, we might never make it back. As a final boss, being used like this is hard on Desco. Dear, oh dear. Right, I think we should actually end this part here, and in the next part, we'll, we'll go off to Smoke of Battle. So we'll see you then. Ta-ta for now.